treated your wounds. We've met once before, although we were enemies then. Don't worry, I don't hold Derida's death against you. I am not your enemy. I brought you here in order to tell you something. Tell me something. Yes, it's about Itachi Uchiha. <laughs> but first, allow me to introduce myself. I am, like you, an Uchiha survivor. And one who knows the truth about Itachi. <laughs> What was that? The Amaterasu, which Itachi seems to have implanted in you. <laughs> Leave it to Itachi to set a post-mortem trap. I can't believe how cleverly he plans ahead. What are you saying? Why would Itachi do such a thing? Don't you get it? <laughs> it was... to protect you. Protect? To protect me? Are you kidding? He... he was the enemy. He killed my mother and my father, and destroyed the clan, and... You do not know everything about your brother. Enough riddles! Tell me what you know! Itachi did mention it, did he not? That he was not alone that night. <sighs> then... you're... Indeed. I am Marara Uchiha. It is your duty to hear the truth about your brother's life. The truth? What truth can you tell me that I don't already know? Itachi... He's fought me and tormented me all these years. And nothing changes the fact that he destroyed our clan! The Uchiha! What would you say if I told you he was given that mission by the Leaf? What? Itachi's assignment that night was to slaughter everyone, and he fulfilled it. But... I don't understand. Itachi... He ended up being a sacrificial pawn in a long-standing power struggle in the Leaf. A sacrificial pawn? The Hidden Leaf Village. It is a large village now, and it has witnessed the birth of many clans throughout history. When the Leaf was founded, we and several other clans held the power in the village. But after failing to take the seat of the first Hokage, we Uchiha gradually fell from power. I, then the leader of the Uchiha, eventually left the village in despair. After my departure, the clan fell even further from power, and in the end they came to be treated as village outcasts. Aware of this, the Uchiha began to develop a plan. A plan?
a plan to take over the village, with your father as their leader, what you would call a coup d'etat. The Uchiha clan? A coup d'etat? And my father was the leader? Yes, but the leaf higher-ups grew suspicious and planted a spy among the Uchiha. That spy was your brother, Itachi Uchiha. <laughs> the Uchiha or the leaf? Itachi was torn apart inside trying to decide which side to take. Ultimately, he sided with the Hidden Leaf Village. Why? Why would Itachi betray the Uchiha? As a boy, he had experienced the Third Great Ninja War. He chose to put the stability and peace of the village first. The village higher-ups played on his feelings and assigned him a mission, and that mission was the eradication of the entire Uchiha clan. <gasps> I can't even begin to imagine his emotions when he heard what his mission was to be. The decision to raise his hand against his fellow clansmen must have been an unbelievable struggle. But if the Uchiha's coup d'etat were allowed to proceed, the village would collapse, and this weakness would invite attacks from other villages. It could easily become the trigger for the fourth great ninja war. And so, Itachi made his decision, that he himself would lower the curtain on his own clan's history. Itachi brilliantly executed the plan, his mission, except for a single mistake. No matter how he walled off his heart to transform into a bringer of death, there was one that even he could not kill, his little brother. Afterwards, Itachi appealed to the third Hokage, beseeching him to protect you. And before departing the village, he warned the other leaders never to lay a hand on you. He worried about you above all else. That can't be. It's not true. It's a lie. Impossible. It is the truth. Liar! I saw him try to kill me again and again! If Itachi really had wanted to kill you, you would most certainly be dead. And what's more, Itachi had his reasons for spurring you on. You don't mean... That battle was all according to Itachi's design. He meant to free you from the curse mark. And by allowing you to defeat him, he could make you out to be the Leaf's hero. The one who avenged the Uchiha clan. No, I won't believe it. He's... Itachi's evil. He's a criminal. He slaughtered the clan and became one of the Akatsuki! Joining the Akatsuki was also part of Itachi's plan. He was spying on an organization which posed a threat to the village. Even after he betrayed his clan and left his village, his heart was with the Leaf. And most of all, it was with you. A lie! A lie! How can you expect me ever to believe that? It's no lie. You meant more to him than... Stop it! It's all a big... You're alive, aren't you? <laughs> Itachi killed his friends, 
his superiors, his lovers, his father and mother, but his little brother he could not kill. Save for his shedding tears of blood, he killed all of his emotions too, and slaughtered his own flesh and blood for the sake of his village. But he could not bring himself to kill you. Do you understand what that means? To him, your life was more precious even than the village. He placed you, his beloved brother, above even himself and sacrificed his life for you. Accepted disgrace in the place of honor, hate in the place of love, and still he died with a smile on his lips. He bequeathed to you the Uchiha name, fooling you to the very end. Big Brother, you promised you'd help me with my Shuriken Jutsu today, didn't you? Oh, I have an important mission tomorrow. I have to study, so... You're a liar! Sorry, Sasuke. Another time. It's just the two of us. I'll always be there like a wall you have to climb over. Even if it means being hated. That's what big brothers are for. Sasuke. My eyes. Mine. Sorry, Sasuke. This is it. We are no longer with Hebi. Hereafter, our platoon will be known as Taka. Taka has only one goal. We... will destroy the Hidden Leaf. The Hawk cried out, just once into the void. It was a voice of lament, a voice of emptiness. And a voice of anger. The boy who carries the burden of his fallen clan now silently turns a dagger toward that place. The curtain shall now rise on war, the revenge of the truth, a settling of things past. His heart filled with grief for his departed brother. The story of a new Sasuke Uchiha. Will now begin.